Good morning, welcome to a brand new day. And today is a brand new day, a new experience for you guys, something we've never showed you before. Um, I cannot wait to explain everything that is about to happen. Um, anyway, first off, we are headed to um, a tax sale. Not actually a tax sale, but it's a local barn. In fact, it's the barn that we got Storm from. Um, he, they are having a sale and they have like lots of pony stuff for sale. They have, um, yeah, this is a big, huge barn sale. People pay for tables and sell their old junk. So we're headed there and I can't wait to buy their old junk. I can't wait to bring you guys along with us. No parking this is gonna be a good sound hopefully cross your fingers we get something really good I'm looking for something for Willow what are you looking for Storm. you're looking for something for storm <gasps> poor Stella I'll look for something for Stella too something pretty in purple no, or pink I'm looking for Willow Gabby's looking for a storm you're looking for Stella okay I'm looking for Stella <laughs> Okay, let's go look at halters. Gabby tried Storm in this barn, you guys. This is the actual barn that Gabby tried him in. Rainbow Rain. We have those right there. Oh, rope halters. Oh, that's adorable. I like the yellow and pink, too. This is five dollars. It's so cute. Perfect. Look at this. Gabby's slinkies, ten dollars each. Lots of polo wraps. Do we need any colors of those? No. We have time. We have Look at this. is a show halter. And that's Willow size probably, is it? No. That's Willow. Look at this Bucus blanket, Gabby. I love this. What, what size is this? First purchase, what did we get? A, um... Chain. I chain. Chain. Chain lead. What's it called? Chain lead rope because we use the one that we have, so... And now this one's mine. A lot of blankets. Holy moly. Yeah, that's a small one. It's a small blanket or what? Oh, so, no. That's a neck. Oh, that's a that's huge, a huge neck. neck. Gabby, it's what we wanted. Ball? Yeah, are they yoga balls or actually horse balls? Like they're yoga, yoga balls. balls, Mom. Okay, but we don't want that. I want these, though. But they're big enough, too. And look, there's a wig. We could dress our horse up. Yeah. We could dress Willow up. Look at we found this pony saddle pads. Yeah. Yeah, they're both adorable. No, we're getting this. We're getting. No, we're getting this one. I like that. What's that one's a blue monkey. I wish they had a pink. Mom, I'm getting it. Do they have a pink one? You think that's Willow size? Yeah, I like it. I like it. Do you think that's the right size? A quarter sheet. It's a nice one. Nice and warm. Second thing purchase of the day we got. Uh, it's a warm quarter sheet. My horse is gonna buck. <laughs> she thinks he's gonna buck no matter what. Strapping. Like we wanted one of those. You put it, it on like underneath your saddle. So you know, yeah. Pony's He's getting a new saddle and a quarter sheet. So we already bought a chain. Oh. See, there's ponies. Where? Nice that's that's his pony stuff. I, I want that. Stuff. That's cute. I want pink or something. Bridal oh, that's bag. a like I'm a. Getting the, wait, wait, wait. It's a I don't, bridal bag, right? It's a bridal bag and it's purple. I like it. Okay, so what do you guys think about hemp hemp products? Because I've been hearing a lot of really good stuff about it. Those are huge treats. That's a green hawk. I'm not sure if it's a bridal thing. She doesn't like that kind of material. Okay, we found this amazing halter that Gabby's in love with and the owner of this halter is named Storm. Is that a sign or is that a sign, right? Perfect. Thank you very much. Color that we need? The blue ones, because I have the matching. You don't have to do that. I have the matching. Oh, that is true. Is it you that has that, or Sophie that has the blue? What kind is it? Yeah, that one's cute. I love the two different colors of leather. It's adorable. We're looking for pony stuff. Yeah, this is really cute. And it's got a whole bunch of space to go up and make it smaller. Like for your cheekies. Yeah, it's cute. Okay, so we just finished um, at the sale and we have something else super special and exciting to show you guys. I'm going to tell you about it in a few minutes. But before we do, we're with Rachel. Hi. Who remembers Rachel? 
Okay, I'm gonna tell you. <laughs> For all you new guys, Rachel used to be at our old barn too before it disbanded. And she has a horse and we're gonna go see her. It's like this week is the week that we're getting to see all of our old barn horses. So um, I'm not gonna tell you the name of this horse. It's a mare and she's a pony. And comment below if you guys remember Rachel's horse's name. It's a tricky one. Look at how far this is, how big this farm is. It's a trail. Oh, this is a trail, so you could go walking on it, like riding on it? Storm went through that trail. Yeah, Storm used to live here. Did you know Storm used to live here? Uh -huh. Did you know Storm was born here? Yeah, it's because he has the branding on him. Yeah, he does have the branding on him. Okay, so she's smarter than me. What can I say? <laughs> uh, there's the round pen. That's nice. We might have that one day. Oh, Look at how cute. So, that's the bad thing about snow. All you see is poop everywhere you go. Look at how big these fields are though. Like, it's kind of cool, huh? I love that they're all hidden. Oh, one of the new horses. he's new. So cool. So this is independent pastures here? Pat, is this independent paddocks here? Oh yeah, those are the horses that don't get along with most of them. Those are the horses that either are new or don't get along with other horses. And then these are the bigger paddocks. Each paddock holds three to five horses. So this is a barn not very far from us. This barn is prim primarily Western, right? Yeah, but there is English. Yeah, no yeah. English. Yeah, and then our barn is primarily English, but then there's a bunch of Western people and a bunch of Dressage people. Whoa. She's like, come back! No, 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 it's a he. Might be a he. Yeah, I didn't check. Did you check? No. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. I'm really glad that our horse is where it is because it's a lot shorter of a walk. Holy cow! And then you have to walk all the way down there? Yeah. <laughs> and she can fit through that, that gate? Yeah. Oh, Stella could never fit through this gate. I don't even know if Storm could fit through this gate. Storm can. Essentially, we're walking along the poop line because it's not icy. <laughs> so poop does have its purpose in the world, you guys. Oh my gosh, look at over there, you guys. Do you guys see that horse over there in the blue blanket? Who's that horse, you guys? She, look at, she looks like she knows us. All right, you guys, who's that horse? I don't, I'm gonna take a picture and post that on Instagram because I know that people are gonna know her. It's a mare. Oh my goodness. So uh, this is Rachel's pony. Oh, she's like, mama, let me rub on you. Uh, so uh, this horse, if you guys need a clue, is on uh, Gabby's channel. No, on Sophie's Sophie. channel. And it was trying horse treats yes. or trying food. Our ponies were trying food. Hi, I got no food. I'm sorry. These are my no horse gloves. These are the gloves I wear when I don't want to smell like a horse. But ponies are okay. I don't mind if I smell like a pony. <laughs> and look at that thing! That's Nessa. Nessa, she is gorgeous. Um, that's my friend's aunt for it. It's gorgeous. So you guys probably know that's a halfling. Oh, look at that beautiful tail. So pretty. And she's just stalking us. I know, and she's just stalking us. She's like, I remember you all! So this is the closest I've ever been to a halflinger. And, and oh, this is like, there are two kind of halflingers. Ones that are like really super stocky and kind of chubby. And some that look like this. Hi. Hi. <laughs> I do not want to smell like horses today. She is overweight, yeah. But not like, oh my God, I'm being attacked by horses. <laughs> so Sophie. <laughs> and, and I use the word attack loosely, you guys. You know that's just my sense of humor. I love you. You're so pretty. I don't think she loves me. She's gorgeous. I love it. It's nice here. Like the big, huge, massive community, but they're all in their own little tiny kind of like herds. That one right there does not look um, like Tex. That one has one blue line, one brown. Yeah, I, I see that. That's cool. Oh. It's okay. They kick at each other. Don't kick at me. No. Oh. All good to humans, they disgrace and them like to get at each other. Yeah, that's her behaviors. <laughs> okay. Like you are them. pretty. We do love halflingers. She is really pushy. Oh, you're pushy. Look at that nose. Look at that nose. Okay. Cutie. Okay, so we're going into the barn. 
and we're gonna show you guys where Storm used to live. We bought him from this barn. Like he used to live in this barn. There's the cat that climbed inside oh, our car. And that's the cat that climbed on top of our car. And what's really cool about this barn, see this is where Storm lived. You guys, back in old videos, you'll see. This is where we came to try him. Oh, this is hers. This is, this is Rachel's horse's stall. So how does this work? Does this come off? Um, they just, I think Alan lifts it. Yeah, so you sweep the dirty stuff into this and then it goes somewhere. Um, this, there's a big track and it just pushes it down to the ends and to the other side. And down there, there's like an, an elevator type thing and it pushes it into the big wheelbarrow. Oh, but, oh, yeah, like this is what I want in my new cat barn because literally you push the dirty stuff on you out of there. Look at how clean it is. Um, I'm checking out the stalls because I want to see if we're doing a good job and I think we are. I think our stalls are just as clean, but look at all the wood in here. It's beautiful. Yeah, it's all made of cedar wood. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, it was either, I think it was 18. I'm sure it was 18. This is where Storm came from. And look, he had a window. Yeah, because it was right by the cross side. Yeah. This is it. This is Storm's old stall, you guys. Yeah, there's a large bay horse that's in here now. A large bay horse. Um, oh, look at how nice. owned by Don. This is, this is uh, how much it's shavings we put in Stella's stall. I feel good about what we're doing. And that's about how much she eats, too. So they have a heated a locker room. So nice. Show us your locker. Can you show us inside your locker? Um, there's a couple of things that Deborah's in here right now. So That's okay. Fine. Don't judge her messy locker. I just want to see what the lockers are like. I like it. I would rather have a uh, up tall up locker. That's cute. I would not be able. Yeah, you guys would not be able to reach. You guys would have to be on the bottom. It's nice. I find it super interesting to look at other people's barns and see how they run them, especially because now I'm trying to do one. Uh, look at this cute little wall here. It's got like a little hitching post and a western setup. This room is the bathroom. Now is the time that we are going to show you something that we have never done before on this channel. Actually, we did do it one time before, and that's a whole other story, but anyway. Guys, look at what halter I got. So it's like, <gasps> blue diamonds. It might know that I have recently got my hair trimmed, and there's something about February. Every February, I get so frustrated with my hair that I can't hack it anymore, and I always wanna get it cut. I try to get the girls to get their hair cut. I just think it's like beneficial, keeps it healthy, and they never want to. Gabby had a really bad experience getting her hair cut. But I don't like it because my hair does not grow back. She likes her hair the way it is. She likes it long. Sophie loves her hair long, but today is the day one of them caved, you guys. One of them came to me this morning and was like, I think I want to get my hair cut. So that's what we're going to do right now. I take one of these girls to get their hair cut. What do you think? I love it. You love it? Let's see. So she has this little tiny bit that's a bit shorter on the side, uh, on the side, and it has a like. It's so super Mom, cute. Get food. And now she's like, I'm so hungry, Mom. Our life is at the point now where no matter where we go, we have to come home by one o'clock because we gotta feed the horses. Um, we stopped by our other barn. Woo! It's cold. We stopped by at our other barn because it felt really cold today, and we wanted to change Storm's blanket back to his warm one, and. They couldn't catch him. He was galloping with his friends. Hi, baby. Oh, you got snow. For all you guys who are saying that Willow needs a blanket, she definitely does not need a blanket. Hi, Tony. Hi. Hi. You guys want some lunch? You guys want some lunch? It's warm in here, you guys. Nice and warm. Anyway, it's okay. She has a really warm coat, and if I put a blanket on her, if I put a blanket on her, she would lose all her hair, and she'd lose the ability to keep herself warm. And I don't want that. I, I definitely don't want that. As long as she has a warm shelter to come into out of the way, out of the... Bella, you're pretty too. You're pretty too. Then she's good. She's all good. All right, so, lunch. What We're going to put it inside. This first. is lunch. Yeah, take it all. Oh. So I posted a picture of Inst on Instagram of 
Stella from a few months ago to now, and it's drastic how much weight she's lost. So I watered their hay again um, because the temperature is a little bit better. When I give them a choice between watered hay, soaked hay, or regular hay, they choose soaked hay. Isn't that crazy? And the other thing I really like about soaked hay is you know how people throw hay out into their field and then it blows away? Oh, soaked hay doesn't blow away. You get to eat it all, huh? Huh, pretty lady. Oh, you're all wet too. Are you warm? She's warm. Oh, I love to give her scratches. I was starting to feel like depressed about our property because it's all such a mess. The other people that used to live here still have all their junk here. It's just junky and looks awful. And I was getting really depressed about it because so much is ripped up and has to be fixed in the spring. And being at that big property gave me a newfound appreciation for how small our property is. I actually like it now. Like I, I actually, I think I like a small property. All right, have a good lunch. Have a good lunch. And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.